Can you tell me what type of words these are? These are modal verbs. So what are modal verbs? Well, modal verbs help to add meaning to the main verb in a sentence by expressing possibility, ability, permission, or obligation. Now, what is the structure of a modal verb and how can we use it in a sentence? So modal verbs never change their form no matter what. There are no present or past participle forms of these verbs. Some verbs, or most verbs, take on the S to form the third person singular. But this does not apply to modal verbs. They don't change, they only have one form. So how can we identify modal verbs in a sentence? Well, modal verbs are always followed by the infinitive form of the main verb without using the word to. In questions, modal verbs come before the subject and can have the word not after them when forming question tags. So now, let's look at four types of modal verbs. The first type, modals of deduction. These modal verbs we use when we are speculating, deducing, or talking about probability. The second type of modal verb is modals of ability. These we use when we are talking about ability, things we can and can't do. The third type of modal verb is modals of permission. Now these we use when we are giving or asking for permission. For example, can I borrow your pen? And the fourth type of modal verb is modals of suggestion. These we use when we are offering suggestions or establishing obligatory rules. So I hope this has helped you understand more about modals and how to use them. I'll see you in the next vlog. Goodbye.